Hi everybody, this is Michelle from Virtual Hand Care, and today I wanted to make a quick video for you guys to help you with cold fingers. So many of you say that your fingers are so cold when you're typing for a long period of time, or perhaps when you're gaming. I'm gonna give you a few ideas, some that don't cost anything, and then some that might cost a little bit of money, but you can decide which one is better for you. One good idea is to use warm water. So I don't recommend you doing this right next to your computer or right next to your gaming console because it's water and you don't wanna get water on any of your electronics. What you can do is keep it on a table close by or perhaps just do it in the kitchen. It'll give you a chance to get up and change positions. Just work those fingers in that warm water for a few minutes and that can really help if your fingers are feeling really cold or perhaps they're really stiff and you need to get that circulation moving again in those fingers. Tip number two is just use your hands and use some friction and movement to generate some heat. And it's also a good way to get a good arm workout in also. Tip number three is using a moist hot pack. I made this one and it actually has rice in it. So for a few bucks, you can make your own moist hot packs. So you can just take some rice and some fabric. And if you are crafty and you can sew, just sew a little moist hot pack together, put it in the microwave for about 60 to 90 seconds and put it on one hand perhaps, put it on both hands for a few minutes. And you can do that as often as you need to. And usually it stays warm for a good 10 to 15 minutes. Now, tip number four is to use a electric heating pad. Now this could be a little more handy for you because you can just plug it in and you can put it on your back, your shoulders, you can put it on your lap you can even fold it over and place your hands in that for a good 10 or 15 minutes. It seems pretty common sense, but sometimes people don't think about things like that. So just another idea. Now this last idea I'm gonna give you is using a glove. And this glove can help you um, perhaps keep the heat a little longer. So I would suggest you utilize one of the other uh, tips that I showed you, such as using a moist hot pack or a electric blanket or electric hot pack. Get your fingers nice and warm and then put your hand in one of these more uh, fingerless gloves. So I like this glove because it has the fingertips free so you could still be able to type, you can still be able to feel the keyboard, you can still be able to use your hands for gaming, you should still be able to move the way you want to move and it doesn't provide any kind of restriction. And it goes up high enough where it still should be able to help hold the heat in your hand. Let me know if that helps. Like my video and subscribe to virtualhandcare.com. If you're looking for tips or tricks, or perhaps you had an injury, or you're having some numbness and tingling from all the gaming or office work you're doing, contact me, Michelle, at virtualhandcare.com. Book a session with me, and I can help you get your hands back to typing and playing your video games.